Right now covering Colorado First in Westminster, a surprise reunion with a beloved friend today for students at Colorado STEM Academy. Class pets typically teach students responsibility and of course how to take care of animals. But as Adams County community reporter Olivia Young discovered, a lizard named Noodle taught them a lesson in public policy. To look at this leopard gecko named Noodle, you'd never know that this classroom's love for him led to months of work and a change to district policy. It's public policy. We can change public policy. In August, Noodle joined Ms. Martinez's fourth and fifth grade class at Colorado STEM Academy. He had an instant impact on students. He's really cute. Students loved and took care of Noodle until they got some bad news. We dug in and realized that there was a clause in the district policy that did not allow for class pets. The policy meant Noodle had to leave the classroom in November. They were heartbroken. I didn't really understand why he had to leave. But the students weren't giving up on Noodle just yet. We just told them the idea and we saw that they kind of liked it. So that, that made us have good hope. For four months, they organized, spoke at school board meetings and drafted a new policy with the district's lawyer. A lot of critical thinking. It was a lot of research. It was a lot of learning, again, the process of creating a policy. I thought the first board meeting, that's when they were going to accept it. but. I didn't know it would take like months. Tuesday night, the school board unanimously approved the new policy. Bum, ba, da, da. <laughs> and Wednesday, Noodle returned to the classroom. When I saw that we, he was here, my eyes blew up. I haven't seen him for like four months. A class pet teaching students a valuable lesson in making change. And if y'all change this policy, do y'all think you can have an impact in other ways? Yes! Now this is a district-wide policy change, meaning these students have opened up the door for countless noodles to grace classrooms like this one long after they've left. In Westminster, I'm Olivia Young, covering Colorado First. Do you think Noodle knows he's the most <laughs> beloved gecko around? Well, if you have a story idea about Adams County, Olivia sure wants to hear from you. So please send her your tips through our website. And by calling Olivia at the tip line, just leave her a message.